Hello, welcome to a video on paperless bookkeeping with ProLedger Online. In this video, we're going to learn how to attach digital receipts to a bookkeeping entry, either on a smartphone or on your computer. And we're also going to learn how you can view those receipts after they've been attached. So stay tuned. Let's get started. Okay, let's take a look at how to attach a receipt using the uh, an Android phone in this example. I'm using my cell phone and on the cell phone I have a, an app button for the ProLedger bookkeeping program and if you want to learn how to set up that button on your Android phone watch the video on how to set up the bookkeeping program on the devices and multiple computers in a separate video. Anyway, I'm going to open up the program and when I open up the file we're going to see I need to go to the record screen. Okay. And in the record screen, I could do a couple of things. I could attach a digital receipt to a brand new bookkeeping entry by using the add record button at the top left, or I could simply take any of the entries that I've already done and attach a receipt to it. So why don't we just try attaching a receipt to an existing entry? In either case, it's the same process. And it's the same process, by the way, on either a, a phone or on the computer. So I open up the enter record screen and about halfway down you're going to see that there's an attachments box and inside the attachments box there's a paper clip and the word add and in that add is what I tap on or select in order to attach some kind of document. Now I can attach PDFs and I can attach basically any image file a JPEG or a ping you know whatever image files you might have as photos and also as PDFs. And you can also attach multiple files to a bookkeeping entry. So let's try attaching. We're out with our cell phone. We just had an expense. So let's use the add button to bring up a couple options. We can use the camera to take a picture of a receipt or we can choose files to attach a receipt that maybe, maybe you got a receipt that's been emailed to you as a PDF or it's on your phone in another storage area or even on your computer you can use files to attach something you already have. Anyway, we're gonna take a picture of a receipt. So we use the camera and we just line that up nicely uh, over the receipt. We hold it still and we take a picture. All right, so we have at the top, you can see we can choose retry or okay. Well, it looks pretty clear. I think I'm pretty happy with it. So I'm gonna click okay. And when we do that, there you go. The, um, you can see the file is now attached as a JPEG to that particular entry. Choose save. And when you do that, it saves it and it actually reduces the file size and saves it. And now you see on that bookkeeping entry on the left side, there's actually a paper clip uh, uh, next to it. So that shows that there's actually a receipt. So I could say, yeah, I got a receipt for that one. I'll change that field next to it to done. And then um, you're done with that. Now, if I want to see that receipt, I can double click on the entry and I can simply tap on the image file and it'll display that image to me on the screen just like that. If you're on a computer, and we'll show that to you, you know, in, a, in, a, in a few seconds here in this video, you can actually right click on that and save it and download it and print it uh, for your records. We'll show you that in this video in a bit. So anyway, that's really all there's to it when you're using any uh, tablet or smartphone. Okay, now I've gone to my computer and I'm looking at the exact same uh, files and records that I did on my smartphone. And you can see, I just, I can now see what I did on my smartphone. There's uh, that entry again. I can double click on it and I can view it here on my computer. And when I do that, I can right click on that image and choose to save image as, and then from there I can print it if I like. So that's how you can manage a JPEG. And you can also attach, like I mentioned, um, let's say a PDF. So let's, a, let's attach that particular item to this as well. And if I want to view the PDF, then I click on it and it actually shows it to me in a nice viewer. I can then um, zoom in on it and I can print it, I can download it. So you'll have a nice archive of your receipts this way. And you can use your desktop scanner, for example, and maybe you want to 
scan all the receipts for a particular week or a month at one time and then just simply do the attachments later. Or if you have your smartphone, as I just showed you earlier in the video, you could just use your camera to take those pictures and immediately that image attaches itself to the bookkeeping entry and you got a nice tidy digital archive of those images. Anyway, that's really all there's to it. Thanks for tuning in.